What's going on everybody? It's me again. Another moto vlog. The day I try to do one when I try to uh, register and uh, inspect my bike. For some reason the GoPro went to uh, camera mode and all it was doing was taking pictures. A lot of the video that I recorded couldn't use. It started out good in the morning. Got my bike. Went and get gas. When I got to a place, I started recording there. When I left, it stopped recording. Go figure. In the inspection, the guy inspecting my bike was saying, hey, your, your lights aren't coming on, your brake lights. So when he said, your brake lights aren't coming on, I, was, I looked at him like, this is a new bike. He's like, really, what year is it? And I told him the year, like, uh, well, how many miles do you have on it? So I told him, he's like, what? You hardly used that thing since last year till now. Uh, uh, we started laughing. So he's like, man, you got to use that. You got to start riding it. I was like, yeah, I'm always working. I started messing with the brakes, pressing it and letting it go. And finally, I got it working. So it started working after that, so he passed the bike. Went to the registration annex, like they call it down here in Texas. I went there, and about a block or two away from the place, it starts raining. I was nervous. I never rode in the rain before. I went inside <clears throat> to register the bike, and I was glad I got there just in time. I had important paperwork in my backpack, important documents. I handed the girl all the papers. She just looks at the renewal paper that they send over the mail. She didn't even look at the title. Mind you, <clears throat> I lost that title. I misplaced it with the separation and everything going on two or three weeks later. And so that's why I never got the bike inspected before that. When I found it, I got happy. I thought she, they were going to look at it. She just grabbed the renewal paper and that was it. So those three weeks were wasted, me trying to trying to find it, even though I had to find it, because that, that's an important document. And I'm glad I found it. But I could have had the bike registered. But I bet you if I didn't have the paper, they would have asked for it. So I paid for the registration, walked out, and it was raining more. It was raining pretty bad, so I had to wait for about 45 minutes. So it stopped raining. I got on the bike, and I'm like, you know what? I need to get home. <laughs> it started clearing up. That day did not forecast any rain but I'm sure that happens everywhere lucky me I got to ride in the rain for the first time this is my adventurous registration slash I hope you guys enjoyed this video this is my first one for the season I'm gonna be working on more stuff we'll see you guys on the next one